My name is Paul Barker, MBE, and I am the current custodian of the state gun carriage. So the purpose of the state gun carriage is to take the reigning monarch on her final journey as part of her funeral. And it is an honour that the Navy have had since Queen Victoria in 1901. The state gun carriage has been used six times. Queen Victoria, Edward VII, George V, George VI. It has also been used for Winston Churchill and Louis Mountbatten. The maintenance of the gun carriage is uh, fairly simple. Uh, the gun carriage has as many original parts as we, we can keep. It's kept in an environmentally controlled environment so that we can prolong that process. We had the wheels refurbished recently and we know that they are date stamped 1901 and we believe that was in preparation for Queen Victoria's funeral. As far as cleaning and maintenance is concerned, there's a lot of grease and oils that need to be applied to various parts and lots and lots of polishing. So a little bit of history about the state gun carriage. It was an original artillery piece pulled by horses. At the end of the 1800s, uh, it was taken out of service as the Windsor gun, with a, a similar gun being the London gun uh, for Queen Victoria's funeral. It weighs approximately two and a half tonnes and can be moved by as little as three or four people. But for ceremonial purposes, we use 144 ratings and officers of the Royal Navy. To keep the traditions and the customs of the Royal Navy, it, it is still seen as an honour to take up this role, um, to be part of the crew. It would be very easy to give that duty back to the army uh, and replace the sailors with horses, but it's a tradition that we, we wish to keep as long as we can.